In our investigation of classification, we're going to look at fish, and in particular, we're going to look at some of the features of the fish. So, uh, kingdom, animalia, uh, chordates, vertebrates, and we're going to look with more detail. And you can see here from the vertebrates, uh, lots of chordates, uh, including uh, fish, and what are their main features? They're going to have uh, gills for breathing, um, an endoskeleton, and scales on their outside. And there are three main classes of uh, fish. And you see that they're fish without jaws, the cartilaginous fish like sharks, and the vast majority of um, uh, this particular classification, the bony fish, um, and there are about 30,000 uh, different types. So review, renew, discover external features of fish. We're going to look at a diagram here and look at the vocab words here. Uh, are there any that are new to you? Are there any that uh, uh, you're very familiar with, and also we've got the uh, back, uh, top, lower, uh, dorsal, ventral, anterior, front, posterior namings, and dividing them into three regions of head, trunk, and tail. So those are the main vocabulary words, and some of the, the words um, have context in everyday life in other areas and which of those do, do you know and here we just put the anterior posterior dorsal ventral on them as well so what can you remember pause here uh, to name uh, the parts of the fish and later on we'll see the key to answer key uh, now you're going to watch a video uh, of a tropical Caribbean fish, uh, but what we want to do is for you to draw it, uh, simplify diagram, and name the fins on your diagram. Suggestion, just start with an outline uh, without the fins, and then you can uh, add them as you see it. And you might have to replay the video as you go, go through. <laughs> complex diagram and this one is the shark, the cartilaginous fish. A lot of the names are, are the same that you've already met uh, but there are some more uh, complex areas, more detailed diagram here and uh, here are some of the explanations as you're looking at those words uh, which ones need a little bit more describing and again, you can pause on this so that you can read it um, uh, carefully to pick up the, uh, the words that uh, you weren't familiar with. And here is the uh, answer key to the activity that uh, you were doing earlier. And the, well, one possible answer key to the blue tang uh, external feature activity. And uh, you're going to look at another short video with different fish, and you're going to look at their external features as you can. Again, you might have to replay the section so that you see it uh, very clearly. Um, and in your mind, look for similarities, differences, jot them down in your notes, um, compared to what you saw on the Blue Tang video or the shark diagram.
that's all for the external features of the fish. Um, and here's just a prelude to the internal anatomy and where we will be uh, going in the future.